And we humans have such a powerful brain, and we waste it. We waste it on worry, on anxiety, on think about it, thinking about things that are not relevant. Spend a lot of energy on engaging in, in, in events and news. And in reality, and I know some of you will throw rotten tomatoes at me, but it's not about fighting for something. It's, <clears throat> the way I see it, it's about building up your consciousness. Because the consciousness of you lifts the consciousness of this planet. And it's multiplying yous, it's many of us, just focusing on within, focusing on the internal transformation and bringing your consciousness up to a higher level, unlocking your DNA to a higher percentage than it is now, will lift the society, will lift the community, will lift this planet. Because if you observe throughout the history, the, the events always respond to what is so when people feel inspired and um, and encouraged and somewhat, they become more empowered. The reality around them changes. They they are more in the future present. So they start creating that future, and that future is less based on the past. And then the leapfrogs happen. The uh, the expansions happen whether it's in the infrastructure, whether it's in technology, whether it's in space exploration, whether it's science, like enlightenment, uh, whatever that might be, but it lifts the entire planet and maybe chunks of the planet because every, every area has different consciousness and some live in the very deep past and some are more future focused. So, and the opposite happens when people are so stuck and bogged in their past, present, and they carry so much baggage, <clears throat> and the emotions are usually of very low frequency, their, their anger, their resentment, and you observe a lot of that. Then it boils up at some level, and then wars happen, and people go and fight each other. And the way nature works, the way universe works, is very uh, organized. It's very objective. We have a free will on this planet, and we cultivate the reality that we want to live in, whether it's based on the inspired future or some heavy past. And, um, and there's cleaning that happens as you know somehow universe always errs on the side of ascension on the side of development on the side of what we call more positive more good and the events are either created by the nature maybe some big atrocious natural disasters are created and a lot of people are taken with them but um, if you look broader at this and you would take a more philosophical look a lot of good comes out of it. It builds a lot of compassion. So this, these atrocities open people up to feelings that have higher frequency, that are more, that are more positive. They are compassion, they are love, this help. You know, you observe it all over when Hurricane Katrina hits or something. People just mobilize and they lift each other up. And that atrocity caused that compassion to unlock uh, and it happens on the micro level it happens on the family level um, so what I'm trying to tell you don't focus as much on following the events and getting engaged in everything and fighting for something or against something the only fight you have to bring is the hide with your past present with your past self to lift yourself up and trust me, as you light yourself brighter, 
you will light the whole community around you, starting with your family, with your immediate circle. They will start changing as you do. <clears throat> Not immediately, but over time. And the more lights are lit around this planet, the higher the consciousness is of this planet, the better we'll live. So shut that TV. Always ask yourself how I'm feeling, how I'm changed after watching what I'm watching, consuming whatever I'm consuming, programming myself with whatever I'm programming. Is it lifting me up? Is it inspiring me? Is it making me feel better? Or I'm caught up in the adrenaline and cortisol uh, emotions because emotions are chemical reactions. That's all they are. If you're caught in that negative stuff, shut that off. Shut that off. Turn it off. Love yourself more.